And we're learning more tonight about the reported underage drinking party on Governor Chafee's property. We're told the Attorney General's office is now reviewing the findings of the state police who confirm they did investigate allegations of an alcohol-fueled graduation bash on Chafee's Exeter estate. A state police report obtained by WPRO Radio says the party was hosted by Chafee's son, Caleb, and one teen had to be transported to the hospital for potential alcohol poisoning. Tonight, the fallout is also impacting a member of Governor Chafee's administration. Eyewitness News reporter Jennifer Mobilia has our top local story. Eyewitness News has learned the governor's top aide lives on the property where that underage drinking party allegedly took place and he says he knew there was a refrigerator on the property full of booze. Governor Chafee's top advisor, Stephen Horahan, lives on the property where 18-year-old Caleb Chafee allegedly threw a party last month. A party that allegedly involved underage drinking and landed an 18-year-old woman in the hospital. Horahan admits to knowing a refrigerator near the pool was stocked with alcohol, but says he never witnessed any underage drinking on the governor's property. At the State House Thursday, Horahan told WPRI.com reporter Ted Nisi, quote, I was at the pool earlier in the day, but I was not at the pool after 5 o'clock when the party was taking place. According to a police report obtained by WPRO, a severely intoxicated 18-year-old woman was hospitalized on Memorial Day after attending Caleb's party. Caleb allegedly told the young woman to leave after becoming ill. She was later found along Route 102 after her friends called 911, according to the report. Wednesday night, the governor had this to say about the latest allegations against his son. Very remorseful and 18-year-olds uh, getting in trouble. And, uh, don't have anything further to say. The Attorney General's office is reviewing the case, but at this time, no charges have been filed. Meanwhile, according to our news partners at the Providence Journal, Caleb Chafee's previous charge of attempting to buy alcohol at a Jamestown liquor store was expunged from his record a day after this alleged underage drinking party took place. Stephen Horahan says he has no plans to resign. In the newsroom, Jennifer Mobilia, Eyewitness News.